Good morning guys and welcome to a new vlog. This weekend's vlog is going to be taking the dog to the vet. And what else are we doing? I don't even know. Yep, my jeans put in the dirt. Oh, thank you. Doing laundry, that's something else too. All right, so decided to wear this today. It is a cold, rainy day. I mean, it's not actually that cold, but like psychologically, it makes you think it, everything's more cold. So I decided to wear my aloe little crop top and my Lululemon leggings. Guys, it's about to be that time of the month and I have been so bloated. I literally went to bed at 8 p.m. last night because I was so tired and my body still like kind of aches because I don't know, sometimes my period just like affects me differently. Yeah, and I don't know, yesterday was just one of those days that just hit so hard that I was like, I was just exhausted. I don't know what it was, but I had clinicals yesterday and I'm supposed to start my period today. So everything has just been like super tiring for me and it shouldn't be, but yeah. Anyway, I got this little one. We're gonna take to the vet, like I said earlier. Yeah, I'll probably get clips on my phone. But first we're gonna get Starbucks before I take her because I have a lot of points saved up and I save up my points for this purpose so I can get a drink before our little vet appointment. And then I don't know what I'm doing the rest of the day. I do wanna brush her real quick though. So I'll see if she will let me brush her. She's exploring my room. She's like never allowed in here because she's destructive still a little bit. So like there's some precious cargo in this room. All right. So there's no way I'm letting a dog ruin stuff. That's why the laundry's in here. Cause I haven't like gotten to fold it yet because I put it in last night and stuff. So I have to do that when I get back. Just got a lot of stuff and dog shit to clean up. She pooped in the house yesterday, guys. Like, oh my God, I cannot. But it was raining, I can't blame her. It was like thundering and lightning. I mean, I wouldn't want to take shit out in the outside either. I can't blame the dog, but still, it's just like, why? I love and hate having a dog at the exact same time. Like, she's such a good dog though. Okay, so I kind of want to brush her before we go to the vet. So what I do to brush her, she actually allows me to brush her if I put a little uh, treat in her Kong and then I put some peanut butter so she can like lick it out. So this is what I do. I have to do this kind of fast because I want to get going. Even though our vet's not that far from us, it's just like still. I just wanna give her a little quick brush and then we will be on our way. I also think the weather doesn't help me being tired. I think it's a combination of things. She knows exactly what's happening right now. She gets so excited. Okay, so it's all filled to the top there. So this is the brush I use to brush her coat out and then I have this and then I always put her on a leash so I can like step on this, you'll see. Um, but I always step on this so she can't like just run away from me. Piper, come, sit. Good girl. So we have this on. I honestly might just take this leash to the vet because there's some people that are really mad about like the retractable leashes, but like she needs that cause she likes to run and stuff and she doesn't pull that much. It's not that big of a deal. I only have a couple minutes to do this. So I'm gonna set you guys on the ground so you can kind of watch. We'll set this here. Okay. Piper sit. Good girl. And that is how I brush her. I didn't brush her as long. Well, that's as long as I pretty much brush her. Um, we get her groomed so she gets like the de-shedding treatment and stuff. I mean, I don't brush her as often as I used to because I just don't feel like she needs it. But when I feel like she needs it, I obviously brush her and she's gonna be seeing the vet. So I wanted to make sure she was all like groomed up. Yeah, I used to brush her every other day, but then she got groomed and she's gonna get groomed every month. So the, the heavy lifting is pretty good when it comes to her coat, but um, I just do like little maintenance things like brushing her. I am no dog expert, nor do I have the patience for it. Her first bath was so bad. Anyway, we're gonna get on the road now and get some Starbucks. I love when the drive through there's only like one other car in front of me because then I can just go through the drive through and even better, pick up my mobile order. I am here for it. 
and now we go to the vet which is basically right across the street from this place so super convenient and that is why i chose to get starbucks i was debating on getting my chick-fil-a chicken biscuit because there was like the staff meeting at this hospital i was at and they had chick-fil-a catering when i went there and it just like triggered me and i was like i need a chicken biscuit but then i'm like you know what i'm already feeling bloated and like kind of like heavy so i don't want to get that because i know it'll just make me feel all greasy heavy weigh me down for the rest of the day that's why i typically don't eat a lot or anything in the morning because like having a big breakfast or brunch or whatever like the rest of the day i'm just like blah and i feel like i don't know that's why i tend to eat at least i try to eat just later in the day because then like I have a heavier dinner so I can feel heavy and tired at nighttime, not when my day is just starting, you know what I mean? I don't know if I'm making any sense, but I just got the chats today. Piper is anxious. I don't know if she like feels like she's going to the vet or not. I don't know, but all right, gotta go. And guys, I just wanted to put this out there. The Starbucks made my coffee absolutely perfect. I don't know what it is. Sometimes they get it and sometimes it just like doesn't taste good. I don't know if it's because they accidentally put like the um, classic syrup in there or whatever. But today it is so nice. It is so strong. It feels like it was made fresh. I couldn't be more happy. That I'm glad I got a venti today. Sometimes I regret it. Sometimes I'm like, yes. Okay, and now we are headed to Wolfgang. I kind of want to make her grooming appointment since we're already out. I mean, we're already out, so might as well make that appointment. We're gonna go to the dog park a little later, or maybe, maybe now, I don't know. But it was really weird because like they had the appointment with us like out in the lobby area, which I found to be like a little weird, but like whatever works. But she's really good. She's a little underweight. They said to just keep feeding her what like I'm going to feed her, which is just like the regular adult science diet food. She's on this like weight loss food. So yeah, we're gonna change it, but he was like science diet is fine. Um, and then what else? We got a copy of her vaccines in English and I, now I have a hard copy, thank goodness, because just showing people this random picture in Spanish, I'm like, I hope they know it's like legit. Like, I don't know. It was just a little weird. Overall, the vet said she was like all good and she has a little bit of like tartar on her teeth and she might be older than what they told us. We are walking, walking, walking. She loves to be out and about. Come on. Okay, so we're back from the vet and I want to show you guys like what I got. You already saw her like treats and she got this little alien this little alien guy she already took the sticker off her appointment went super well she is a little underweight they weighed her in at like 17 point something pounds and she's supposed to be like 20 pounds um she is microchipped but i need to make sure i register that with me instead of her previous owners um science diet or adult dog food is good um we, she's on this other food by science diet but we're gonna switch it and then i got this flea and tick medicine for her um they said to do this like i don't know i have to read the instructions but i also got like this heartworm medicine and i'm supposed to give that to her like every month and i'm gonna start it like next month the girl at the front desk said that was fine and i have like some notes here and then also, I got a copy of her vaccinations, thank goodness, because that's obviously important. And it's in English, it's not in Spanish, so I can understand it. The vet also thinks that she's a little bit older than what we're told, but I have no idea. Overall though, good, successful trip. I'm glad that she's like in good health and everything, so that makes me happy. Yeah, so it's pretty much the update. I'm thinking about taking her to the park. I just have to check the weather. I should have just taken her, but I had to go to the bathroom. So we came home and stuff. Uh, there's a little bit dishes and laundry I have to get done. So I'll probably end up doing that and then we'll go to the park, depending on the weather. But overall, she got good treats and she got a new toy.
So we decided to come to the dog park and oh, maybe she wants some water. There's nobody here, obviously, because it's supposed to be like raining and stuff. She's gotten to run around a little bit, which is good. I hate when there's no dogs here, but it's all right. It's been kind of quiet though in town too. Not many people out and about. You want water? They have this cool thing here where you just press this button and then water comes out. But yeah, we are going to stay here for a little bit longer. I'm glad she can run around a little bit because she really needs this. I also love that she just runs and everything even when there's no other dogs here. Like sometimes you have to like instigate it with like playing with a tennis ball or something, but she does run by herself, which is good. Good morning, guys. It is the next day and I was debating on like waiting to vlog a little bit because Valerie's cooking tonight and I was like gonna vlog that but I want to edit this video so I know it's probably like kind of short but I just wanted to post something because I haven't like posted I'm not like consistent like I used to be and it bothers me so bad but I'm gonna get up a video today like right now and oh before I end this I want to say good thing I didn't have Chick-fil-A yesterday for breakfast because we actually ended up having that for dinner because we we're gonna have Panera but then plans changed and the drive-thru wasn't activated we had this like recording and it literally like spilled this like like script the recording did and we actually ordered and like no one was there it was kind of silly but anyway interesting and awkward i'm like wow we look like idiots and then we went to chick-fil-a because i had a drive through and it was like raining and stuff so yeah wait before i actually in this video i wanted to say i did like a deep cleaning of my room so like well, I didn't take the trash out because that's the trash from the cleaning, but I'm going to do my bed sheets today. Um, I didn't vlog yesterday doing the um, cleaning because like, I don't know, I just find it to be, I just find it to be kind of boring, but I did the mirror. I did what I could over here. This uh, little table here tends to get dusty, so I just did that. Like I said, I'm going to do the bed sheets. I did the bathroom, like the mirror, everything. And then bathroom, clean the toilet. Every time I know my toilet needs cleaned, like I know everything needs to be cleaned. So then clean the bathtub and yeah. So it was productive. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am so tired still because I don't know why like this period this month is like not it's just not it, but it's okay. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.